What's up guys, this is your boy Russian and today this is not a clickbait, we're actually gonna have Rappel's news. And no, I am not using that time to actually talk about changes in the channel or anything. A um, couple of things I need to hit about Rappel's news, but uh, let's go on with the video. Alright guys, so first of all, before we cover the events coming up uh, in the game right now, uh, let's discuss a little bit about uh, what are going to happen to Rappel's news, and that's really quick, don't worry about it. Uh, so one of the things we got going to be doing is, I will be covering the news on some month, unless a major event comes up, uh, mostly because play to bit right now, it's releasing the schedule of events coming up, at least the percentage events uh, ahead of the time, the beginning of the month, so I'll let you guys know what's going on on that. Now, one thing that actually got me a little bit puzzled was um, we are right now in the Lunar New Year's, and every year, for at least uh, most part of the decade or more, we have been having the Chinese New Year uh, events. And that's something that is not happening right now in the most when the Lunar New Year started in February 1st. So a couple of days ago, um, I saw no updates on this event. Um, I don't know if they're gonna do later in the month. Still kind of weird. Uh, I know they have other events going on, but I don't know. I think that's something that most players have expected to happen. I mean, everybody like tomatoes, right? But I don't know. Uh, we gonna have to see what's gonna happen on that. Uh, I'll try to find some answers on that. And if I can, I'm gonna make sure to post in the channel. All right, and now, so not to waste you guys' time, we're gonna jump right in and cover the events coming up, everything that is on the calendar. And another thing that is not a waste of time is for you guys to hit that subscribe button, notifications bell, like, and leave a comment for the channel. That helps a lot. All right, so let's jump right in. All right, guys, so let's first start with the monthly regular events for February. So between February 2nd and February 22nd, the server's gonna be running a 30% XP buff. So great time for you guys to be able to get those levels, um, try to reach 200, that's what I'm going to be doing. So that's great, hopefully we're going to be able to find some parties to get your devil done. February 4th to February 7th, so those now are weekend events, right? We're going to be having plus 20% taming. That's all great, but to be honest, lately I have been having horrible luck taming, even with higher cards than I used to have, so hopefully that plus 20 gonna help. Um, let's see how that goes. February 11th to February 14th, plus 10% enchantment, so if you guys need to get your equipment in order, probably that's the best time. What I would say is use those weeks right now to be able to get enough materials to do everything you guys have to do. February 18th to February 21st, plus 250% drop. That's what it said, like, if we were having the Lunar Year event, that would be great. Right now, unless they actually put something else for drops, that's great if you guys are gonna try to get Yushiva belts and everything else. But for the most part, a lot of that stuff just gonna be added to inventory space. But still, you know, um, I'm not going to complain. February 25th to February 28th. Skill card plus 10%. Um, skill cards, uh, I know a lot of people will fight to get it higher. Uh, and almost with a 250% drop, you guys may be able to get enough cards to actually, you know, get better stats. Not a bad thing. And now, our schedule for March 4th until March 7th. A plus 10% enchantment, what is great when it comes right after a 250% drop increase. Alright, so this month's major event is to celebrate the Beijing Winter Olympics. Uh, Rappel's going to be having its own old games, Olympic Games. Now, just so you guys know, this event is going to start in February 3rd after maintenance, so already started. 
and it's gonna go until February 22nd. All right, so a few things about this event. As I mentioned, we have the plus 30% experience buff event. Now, just so you guys know, uh, since basically the servers are in the US, France, and Germany, so for each meta one from the countries we have servers, we're gonna have a buff event extension of eight hours for each. What it means, if we win about five medals, no matter which ones, we're gonna have a 40 hour extension. All right, second, we're gonna have a level up event. Now, to be able to participate, uh, only new characters created gonna be able to actually compete. And the top 10 characters to reach the highest level during the event will be awarded. Now, for sure, if we have two people that reach the same level, they're going to be looking in who actually got to that level in the shortest amount of time, meaning whoever created the character later. There are also going to be a Citadel time attack event where they're going to check the top five guilds on the Citadel rank board every maintenance, and they're going to pick up 10 guilds and award them. There are also going to be a Devil Skeleton Hunt event, so Rappel's going to award up to 10 players who have the most Devil Skeleton kills during the event period. And again, just like the level up event, the same number of kills will be ranked based on the date and time they've reached that number. And at last, the Destroyer Solo Hunt event. So for this event, they're going to award up to 10 players who have the most destroyer solo kills during the event period. And again, same kill number is going to be based on date and time they reach that. Now, I am not going to list uh, the prizes for each event, but I will leave a link in the comments so you guys can take a look. Uh, if you guys are on Discord, you can find that on the rappels and announcements. So, good hunting, guys! All right, guys, so that's everything we know as for right now that is going on in February. And let me know what you guys think. Do you think we're missing anything? Do you think anything that could be done to improve the game? Uh, let me know in the comments. Uh, again, don't forget to subscribe, leave me a like, hit that notifications bell, and leave a comment. Again, you guys got to this point of the video. You guys are legends. And don't forget, as always, I'll see you in the game.